Welcome back, everyone. Before the season started, when you were trying to find some wins for the UConn football team on their schedule, today's game against South Florida is one of those games you thought, yeah, they could win. They had a good shot at winning. But Bob Diaco's team comes up a little short on homecoming at Rensselaer Field. Second quarter, no score. South Florida quarterback Quentin Flowers connects with Rodney Adams. He's going to take off. A couple moves later, he's into the end zone. 44 yards for the score. Now, the UConn offense moved the ball well all day long. Eight seconds to go in the half. Arkel Newsom, the former Ansonia standout, makes the catch. Instead of getting out of bounds, he tries to score and is tackled at the seven-yard line. He knows he made a mistake. Now, the Bulls were fired up heading into the locker room. They had a 7-3 lead. Second half, quarterback Bryant Sheriffs of UConn calls his own number. He rushed for 100 yards today, also passed for 365, gets a great block from Alec Bloom, and he's gone. UConn's out in front 10 to 7. USF would take the lead at 14-13, and they tack on a couple more touchdowns. Flowers can't find anyone, so he does it himself. 15 yards, it's a 21-13 USF lead. Flowers would seal the deal with another long touchdown pass to Adams and the Huskies. Well, they added a late score, but it wasn't nearly enough as they lose it. 28 to 20. Eric Dobratz was there and has more from Rensselaer Field. If you take a look at the stat sheet from this game, you would have thought the Huskies won by two touchdowns. But instead, they lose to the South Florida Bulls in a game that Coach Bob Diaco called maybe his worst loss as head coach. And I take full responsibility. I uh, take full accountability. It's a sad, hard loss. Losing is probably one of the worst things ever, um, especially right now on, you know, homecoming. And I'm a guy from Connecticut, so I take great pride in it, and it, 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 it really does. It, it hurts bad, like real bad. In the big scheme of things, yards don't really matter um, when you're not putting up points. And we didn't put up enough points, and that's why we lost. So a homecoming crowd goes home disappointed. The Huskies now hit the road to take on Cincinnati next Saturday. With the Huskies in East Hartford, I'm Eric Dobratz, News 8 Sports.